So the first thing you're going to do is go to ourworldindata.org. This is the website that you want to go to. From there, this website provides just tons of information about our world. So I'm going to look at like smoking rates in our world. So you can already see there's tons of data being brought up. I'm going to go into the entry, look at there's global health, cancer, the coronavirus, terrorism, life expectancy. Um, so there's so many different things you could look up. So I'm going to that smoking entry. And what I'm going to look for is some graph, some data. Again, they have tons of information here, but here, all our charts on smoking. That's one that I'm interested in. Particularly, I want to look for the trends. Here we go. The trends of what's happening with smoking. So already the Our World and Data site has just given me different countries. You can see I have the Philippines, China, India, the world, the United States, Nigeria, whose smoking rates are way low. Maybe I don't want all these countries. Maybe I'm specifically, I don't want China or India or Nigeria. I want the U.S., the world, and I don't know, I've been to Italy uh, and I know, you know, France, they have higher smoking rates, I think, in Europe. So let's see what happens with these different smoking rates. Oh, interesting. I'm actually surprised that France and Italy are less than the United States and, you know, kind of less than the world here. I thought there was more smoking in Europe, but anyways, notice here the death rate from smoking starts at 1990. I can actually change that if I want. I could start it at the year 2000, whatever I'm kind of interested in here. So that's something important to note. Um, if you want to go to the data site, uh, you're going to need to download a file. So that's not going to be the best site for you. Um, map is always really interesting, um, but the map is just giving it to you for one year. So we want the chart. And specifically, you're going to want some points because you're going to be estimating what you think the slope of this line is and where it's going to end up in 2070. So you can see here, um, I'm going to take our United States data. And in 1990, there were 166.51 deaths per 1,000 people. Know what my data is actually telling me. The deaths per 1,000 people, or 100,000 people, apologize, 100,000. So that's one point that I might take. Um, to remember it, I'm either going to write it down. For me here, I might actually just screenshot it. Okay, could take a couple other points here. I'm going to look at it in 2000, 10 years later. The United States death rates from smoking in 2000 were 124.16 and again I'm going to look at it in 2010 gathering that data I'm going to screenshot it so now I have some data points this is critical for your next step